In this video, I am going to explain drilling operation. How to prepare a CNC part program for simple drilling operation. Now let us consider this given workpiece. It is given the four holes we need to make the drilling. The dimensions of the workpiece is given. Overall workpiece is 90 by 150. And each hole at, uh, at one corner what the dimensions that everything is given in this workpiece. Okay. Now these four number of holes with the given dimensions we want to make drilling using the CNC drilling. For that we need to prepare a CNC part program. In this we are using the G73 pack drilling cycle. Using the G73 pack drilling cycle we make the drilling of the workpiece. Now let us see that uh, syntax. The G73 X, Y, Z, R, Q, F. This is the syntax for G73 cycle. So, what is the X? That is the hole, the portion of the hole, X coordinate of hole and Y coordinate of hole and Z, the depth of hole or retract value. The retract value means the drill is not continuously drilling and going inside. It will go and come back and it will go and come back. So, for retract, the above lift of the drill bit, what amount the drill bit will lift that you can mention with this letter R. And Q is the depth of each pack. So, how much go inside the workpiece that you can define this Q value. And what feed rate that drill bit will go inside that you can define by the letter F. I hope uh, everyone can understand what syntax you used for this pack drilling cycle. X coordinate of hole, Y coordinate of hole, depth of hole, retract value, depth of each pack and F is the feed rate. Now, this is the, the program uh, for the pack drilling and I want to show the simulation for better understanding of this port. Now, let us first take the workpiece. Now, I taken this suitable workpiece of the dimension 90 mm by 150 mm. And I defined the origin of this workpiece at this lower left corner. And the dimension is 000. And I am placing XY plane on the top surface of the plate. And Z is the depth. Okay. So now, the surface Z value is 0. And inside Z value is negative, And above Z value is positive. Now, I define the reference point for this mission that is the ORP. Then, I want to prepare a tabular form for these four holes. We, I want to make the four drilling holes. Each hole dimensions I want, I want to prepare before going to write the program. Now, the point 1, that point 1, the coordinates of the point 1, X value is 25 and Y value is 20. And the next second point, now define the second point P2. That x value is same 25 and y value is 70. Next point 3 that is defined x value is 125 and y value is 70. Next point 4 that you can define the x value is 125 and y value is 20. Now these are the four points where we want to make the drill operation. Okay. Now let us see the program. First code is G21 and G94. So, G21 is metric units and G94 is a drilling site. Next is G91, G28, Z0. That means here G28 is a home portion or a reference point. The tool first will send the tool to the reference point. That the tool is bring to the reference point. Next, workpiece is sent to the reference point G28, X0, Y0. The workpiece is sent to the reference point. Then change the tool, required tool, that is M06, T01. Now the drill bit is mounted on the T01. Then I selected this drill bit. Next, spindle starts rotating in clockwise direction with a speed of 1500 RPM. The spindle started. Next, bring the tool from the reference point to the tool entry point. Here I defined the tool entry point is uh, each point just above the point, 5 mm above the point. Okay. That I mentioned G90 X 
g00 x25 y20 z5 here g90 is absolute units g00 is a fast traverse rapid movement of the tool from the reference point to the tool entry point and tool entry point dimensions are given at point 1 that is a 25 x value 20 is the y value that value is a 5 just 5 mm above the workpiece next we will start the drilling operation now we are using the the spec drilling cycle g73 i mentioned so g99 g73 x25 y20 z minus 10 so the 10 mm will goes inside okay that is here see the q1 r 0.5 uh, one means each time it will go 1 mm depth and retract 0.5 mm 1 mm depth 0.5 mm like that the tool will make okay with a feed 75 mm so now the first drill operation is completed then go to the second point okay now move the uh, tool bit from the point 1 to point 2 okay then then you can give the uh, the coordinates uh, that is uh, n45 x25 y70 okay so now you can mention this x25 y70 then tool will move, move from p1 to p2 okay so there uh, again you can start okay now you can enter this so the cycle will uh, take care of okay now you can enter it will take care of the drilling is happening at point 2 so now again you can move from point 2 to point 3 that is a x125 y70 then you can make the uh, drilling at point 3 now you can see that it's going uh, and making the drilling and the drilling is completed okay next coming to the point 4 that is x125 y20 so here also we can make the drilling it's go inside drilling and uh, moving up okay so now the drilling of all the four uh, points are completed then you can cancel the drill cycle okay so otherwise uh, that it will uh, um, if not cancelled uh, the tool is uh, remember only the drill cycle that movements will happening each and every time so before going to the next operation you have to you need to cancel that cycle for that you can use a g18 okay g18 cancel the drill cycle that is the pack drilling cycle cancelled okay then we'll go for the 91 g28 z0 so rapid movement uh, uh, go to the home position reference point the tool will send to the reference point workpiece will send to the reference point all at workpiece that the reference point is there okay then uh, m05 the spindle stop you can stop the spindle then the m30 the program and and rewind okay so this is the the program we need to write to, to perform the drilling of these four drill points that point p1 p2 p3 p4 you can complete the drilling i hope everyone understand how we can pre prepare a uh, part program for making the drilling operation